Look at this beautiful view. Oh my god. Look, you can see the sea there. What? Do you see that? Whoa. Well, I'm up for the challenge, yo. Not a problem. Guys, the building behind me was built in 1990s and currently is the tallest building of Weihai City. Everybody knows that China is an infrastructure giant, but did you know that out of all the super skyscrapers, 70% of them were built by China? Are you like me, curious about skyscrapers? Let's learn more about it. Now we're about to explore this beautiful thing. This is Chinese fourth generation high rise building machine. Let us get over here. Look at this beautiful view. And now I want you to meet the chief engineer of this project. I want to ask him more about how this building is being built. This project is being built with China's fourth generation high rise building machine which is also our exploration target today. Mr. Song told me that the high-rise building machine resembles a mobile factory for making buildings. It's an intelligent construction platform for mechanical operations, intelligent control and cast-in-place reinforced concrete. All construction work is done floor by floor in the air, and so it is also called an aerial building machine. It's like a hat on the building under construction. As the hat rises, the building gets taller day by day. Oh guys, this is so beautiful. Just look at this place. And this city is so beautiful. Look, you can see the sea there. After discussion, I learned that as the aerial building machine climbs, a vertical factory assembly line forms. Workers complete reinforcement binding, formwork erection, concrete pouring inside the factory, which greatly improves the efficiency. It used to take at least 10 days to half a month to build a floor, but things are different now. Wow! Four days, guys! To complete one store, like one level of the building. That's a lot.首先我们把安全带系好呗我们整个这个模板一个呃智能顶升的一个装置就是我们可以靠这个葫芦变更的是人为控制的哦下面的那个模板是吧对对对把它升起来以前呢是靠人为去去抬或者是人为去去去合模
Mr. Song, explain to me that traditional construction process was very time-consuming and laborious, as each new floor required dismantling the old scaffolding and building up new scaffolding. All the materials were transported by hand or by crane to the new floor. With this intelligent jacking platform, which is like a big box, the operating shelf does not need to be erected manually, and all the materials can be hung on the top equipment shelf to ascend to the new floor, like taking an elevator. According to Song, the building machine is reusable. The lightweight design of the fulcrum system and the standardized and universal design of components were made to accommodate buildings of different structures. After construction, the equipment is removed and relocated to a new construction site. Hey, I think we're done, guys, here. We're done. 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 <笑>是不是很大惊喜嗯这是什么呀这个也是今天的一个惊喜任务啊我们的空中造楼机目前修建的是一个共五十四层两百七十多米的一个摩天大楼今天呢我想给你发布一个挑战任务想让你在十五分
Guys, it's been such a great experience to be on a real construction of a real skyscraper, which uses the Chinese unique high-rise building machine technology, which allows the whole process to be much more power efficient, smarter, and safer. That's what makes China develop their infrastructure with such a crazy speed. Guys, what a day, but that's not all, because there's more in our next episode, and I'll see you there.